I'm getting geared up to do a hike up to the Emerald Pools in Zion National Park. Uh, just arrived this morning and you know, even in the, the cold of winter, and the park's a popular place. Uh, I, was, I was fortunate to find a, a spot to park the car, so I'm eager to get out on the trail. Uh, this hike is gonna take me <laughs> three or four times as long as it would if I was just walking, because I keep stopping to take photos like every every turn. I'm not kidding. This is this is going to end up being like my only hike of the day at the pace I'm going. Uh, but I can't pass up this composition. Uh, you know, sun's just coming over the uh, the high part of uh, well, I'll just say, I guess we'll say the east wall of the canyon. And it's going to light up the river and then you know the the mountains in the background. Uh, it's it's just it's just gorgeous. It's just absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, there's more light uh, than I think the video camera's picking up. You can certainly see the west side of the canyon walls here is, is lit up, and there's already some reflections of the color in the river. Uh, I've got to set up and you know, got the got the tripod ready to roll here. Just uh, need to get the camera set up, grab a few photos, really straightforward. I'm going to go F11, play with the polarizer a little bit just to see if I need to cut any uh, reflection or glare off of that water, but it's looking pretty nice right now. I like that color. Sun is uh, full on strength now. It's not being blocked by the clouds anymore. Uh, it's starting to wash out the color a little bit, but I, I see some shady areas coming up here. But I had to stop because of the the waterfalls. There's a couple uh, gentle, you know, thin streams of water falling uh, uh, as I approach Emerald Pools, and uh, yeah, it's it's one of those uh, waterfalls. Scott's got to stop and take a photo. to the lower emerald pools. Uh, the waterfall's nice, it's closer. Uh, there's a trail that goes around behind it and I think I'm gonna skip that today. I don't feel like uh, getting sprayed with water and uh, then being in a chilly valley. The light's just too harsh right now for, uh, for you know, a, a solid photo. These will be the, uh, the I was here type photos. Yeah. And, um, and, and those have value too, yeah. good memories. So reaching the upper pools, uh, it's a climb, it's a scramble, uh, but I'm glad that I came up here. Uh, it's also nice and shady at the moment, which helps. It's all, yeah, it's really pleasing. This little alcove, you know, nice, uh, very gentle waterfall. Hasn't been a lot of uh, precipitation in the area recently. And then just the patterns in the rock, even the patterns in some of the, the foam that's being created in the water as it uh, kind of ebbs and flows, you know, gathers and slows down and speeds up. It's, uh, it's really interesting. So there's uh, many photo opportunities to be had here. So I found myself a little perch, uh, just sitting down on a, on a rock in front of a, just a small little set of cascades, polarizing filter. I'm using a three stop ND just to get about a quarter to a half a second to drag on the shutter, smooth that water out a little bit, use the polarizer to cut the glare, and uh, mainly focusing on the composition at this point. I'm, I'm thinking about uh, cropping it as a 16 by nine just to eliminate a couple of the drier rocks, which uh, they're, they're less photogenic for me. I, you know, I, I, I like the, the, the ones that are a little bit wet, a little bit slick with, uh, with the stream water. Emerald pools are not particularly emerald at this time of year, but I have to say this golden brown is is really striking. Uh, several compositions want to work with uh, using some of these foreground stones. Uh, I will not try to capture the entire waterfall because the top of that waterfall is just 
way, way, way up there. So we'll just use uh, use the lower part of it here and concentrate on these uh, really lovely golden browns. Well, uh, I'm wrapped up at Emerald Pools, so I have to hike back down, take a break along the way, have a snack, all that good stuff you get to do when you're hiking. Thank you.